Meantime, let's talk about Phil Hughes, uh, get an update from James Bracey on this breaking news that we've got this afternoon. Um, Brace, tell us, what is the situation for Phil Hughes? What's happened and what's his condition like? David, Phil Hughes is uh, currently at St Vincent's Hospital in Sydney. He was rushed there a short time ago via ambulance. Uh, this all came after he was hit in the head by a Sean Abbott bouncer in the Sheffield Shield match between New South Wales and South Australia. Now, uh, the, the, you have to excuse the pictures because they are a bit grainy. These have been taken off the internet and this is a developer story as we speak. He was 63 not out, stood there quite stunned for a while, then face first straight into the pitch. Now, medicos came onto the ground. Uh, the play was abandoned temporarily at the time. Doctors worked on him for up to 30 minutes uh, before play was abandoned completely for the day. He was knocked out cold and there were reports that CPR was attempted to. He's currently listed as critical, has been rushed to hospital. A helicopter did arrive on the ground at the SCG, but he did leave via road in an ambulance. As mentioned, he is at hospital as we speak in a critical condition. He's playing in this match, 63 not out at the stage, trying to put his hand up to replace the injured Michael Clark in the first test against India next week at the, at the um, at the Gabba starting on Thursday week. So, look, it's, it's, we're only getting uh, bits and pieces of information out of the Sydney cricket ground as we speak, but the pitches really do speak for themselves as well. And the cricket fraternity right around the country at the moment where there are Sheffield Shield games going on all around uh, in the lead-up to this test series with players vying for one or two spots. Uh, this has um, sort of taken everyone a bit by shock. So no play for the rest of the day at the Sydney Cricket Ground with uh, all the thoughts from the cricket world uh, firmly on Philip Hughes uh, making a, some sort of recovery from this. But it was very clear he was knocked out, David. Uh, quite a shock too um, for uh, those there at the ground obviously seeing this. There were also reports that curtains were draped around Philip Hughes whilst he was being worked on by medical teams as well. So scary stuff uh, and quite unexpected too. Uh, but somehow, obviously, despite wearing a helmet, suffering severe injury to his yeah. head today, David.